The PSCAD Resources is a new way of managing projects with many dependencies. To illustrate this, we're going to set up this case to run in PSCAD 463. This case has dependencies on a Fortran file, a DLL, and a .lib file. Let's start by linking in the files. Go to Project Settings, Link, and now select the library you want to link in. Next, we'll go to the Fortran tab. and select the Fortran file to link in. The last file to link in is a DLL. In order to do this, we need to run the project to create the temporary folder. As you can see, it doesn't run. When we tried to run the case, it compiled everything and created the temporary folder. Let's go to it now. In order to include the DLL, you need to right click and copy the DLL and paste it into the temporary folder. And you can see here it ran successfully. This procedure of setting up a case is quite cumbersome. Let's see how it's done in PSCAD version 5. In version 5, there's a new resources folder. You can access it through the tree. Simply right click and you can add different types of files to the resources folder. In our case, we're going to select Other. From here, you can simply select the three files that we need to run this project. Now, you can see the three files included under the Resources node. The one last thing we need to do is to make sure the DLL gets copied into the temporary folder. Simply right click on it, go to its settings, and from here you can see an on project compile option. Right now, copying files says no action, but we want this file copied to the temporary folder. And that's it. Now your case is set up. You can see it running. This has been a quick overview of the new resources in PSCAD version 5. We hope that you've enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.